Hello. Okay, so the mag works. Mag works. Ba -da -ba -ba -ba. Okay. I'm just going to do a sound check in the music. Hey, hey. I'm just doing sound checks in the game at the moment. Bear with me. How are you? Just seeing how, la uh, how much I need to turn the game down. Just seeing how, la uh, how much I need to turn the game down. That's fine. That's fine. It's just uh, the music's very loud on this particular game mode. Oh, I look awful today. I'm so sorry, everyone. I don't look great. <laughs> Yeah, I'd rather use a Japanese audio just because I've played Hunk so many times that listen to the English audio over and over again, it's, it's so weird. No, not today. I like, I've got a problem with my hair at the moment. I, I just, like, I'm so unhappy with my hair. <laughs> I, I can't tell you why, it's just... It's just one of those feelings I've got. <coughs> Let's go. K twelve ni tojek. Kaiju kiten no shoutai. Naruhodo. Shinigami to yobare ru wa. Kaiju kiten no kiju. How are you anyway? Yokai. <laughs> I uh, know, I had to get a face cam at some point. Do you know what I mean? That's. And we didn't have a choice. That's. We didn't have a choice. I felt like uh, the channel wasn't really going anywhere. And I thought the most logical step was to get a face cam and see what people think. And it's been a success, I'll be honest with you. People are happy with it, so. Yeah. And it was it was actually reasonably priced. It only cost like I think like fifty nine pounds. You got tooth pain. You've been drinking too much sugar. You had too much sugar. I did that if I had too many energy drinks. Ouch, that doesn't sound great. That's awful, actually. That sounds fucking awful. No health. 
health insurance. Yeah, I have no health insurance to fix. So they show at the moment. That's disgusting, you know. I don't get why. I really don't get why free health service isn't a global thing. Makes no sense. Just move. If you ever get a chance to move out of America, move out of America. It's so aggressive. Everything's about money over there. Like, you know better than me. Ameri Honestly, though, if you're talking about healthcare s uh, services, the NHS over here is no better. It, it, despite it being free, it's not like a fantastic system. <laughs> Good stuff. It's looking good. It's looking good. It's looking good.
be fine. By the way, this is the only game I'm going to be live streaming for a very long time. Just so everyone knows. I, I want to try and get top five in the world, at least. That dog is an absolute prick. Like a hundred and ten percent that dog is a prick. <sighs> I hate that dog. He's so bad, he's so aggressive, it's like it's pure RNG. <laughs> I, I use a strategy where we can sort of slip past him, but... strategy there where uh, basically normally I use the shotgun don't on the zombie but there's a strategy where you can kind of touch that uh, ledge just before he starts to make a bite and you can bypass having to use the shotgun altogether but uh, it, that again is also RNG based completely dependent on his behaviour on that day but it is what it is. So, Nat, son. I'm just going to call you Nat. How are you anyway? How's your day been? Apart from your toothache, how's everything been? Okay. <laughs> Ah, good stuff. By the way, I apologize. This is very reset heavy. There's going to be so many resets on this live stream. <laughs> But that's the nature of speedrunning, I guess. Maybe I should position the camera differently because I don't know whether it's good to have it directly on me or whether it's to have it on the side of me. I don't know. I don't know, actually. Is it okay? Because for me, it's like I've got, I've got a really big forehead, but I have loads of hair, as you can tell. I prefer my side profile. Look, well, side profile. Front profile. 
I prefer the side profile, to be honest. Yeah, this is going to be like, this is extremely reset heavy. That's too bright. I did the whole campaign on critical, the hardest difficulty. That sounds awful, I'll be honest. <laughs> it sounds fucking awful. RPG rushed through without grinding level. Oh. You know it's really difficult about live streaming with a camera and getting the lighting right. Bastard dog. K twelve ni project. Kaiju ten no shoutai. Naru ho. Shinigami to yobare ni. Kaiju ten no shibu. Anshin shina. Shinigami san. Rakuo shike seimon ni mukatte ru. Soko de pick up da. Gokai. Da. Da. Should have been a reset, but I'm not resetting. Not that one, anyway.
Ah, oui, oui. Oh, so, uh, Natsu, have the live streams been better recently? What have you, what have you been live streaming? So difficult live streaming. K12 ni tojeka. Kaiju kiten no shoutai ya. Naruhodo. Shinigami to yobareru wa kai. Kaiju kiten no shibi. Kaiju shou wa shinigami san. Nakuo shike de sen. Eh? That Natsu. Oh, but come here. No, I don't want to. Come here. No, it's fine. You can see Natsu. Lady Pizza. Hi. He said, he said, hey. He said, hey, hey. Yeah, she was playing Devil May Cry. She loves that game. I can't stand her. Not that they're bad games, it's just like, I, I can't figure it out. Honestly, honestly. Ah! Problem is that dog is what kills the run no matter what. Even if like I'm carrying on here now, but that dog fundamentally, if you want to sub seven minutes, you need to make sure you get that past that dog untouched. So it's the worst reset place to be honest. What is it? USB? Just bear with me, everyone. So we got a spare one. Shotgun. Off. No, no, no. That's not the... Sh uh, the problem is with that... <sighs> um, oh, yeah. I'm not, yeah, I'm not using it right now. Uh, you can actually get past them. I have a video on Twitter, uh, a guide to get past them without ever using any shot. Like, someone had an argument with me today. Yeah, the flash grenade, right, that's the one. That's the argument someone was having with me today about the flash grenade. That's a very old strategy. That's like at least like two year old strategy where the Chicky Chen strategy, what I use, right, it's not consistent, but when it works, it saves you 20 seconds. I'd rather work on a 20 second time save than a strategy that only saves me maybe five seconds. And because uh, I'll, I'll link you the video actually, if you don't mind. It's one of my favorite, <laughs> honestly, it's mine and my wife's favorite YouTube video of all time. It's our favorite YouTube video. We go back to it like religiously. I'll show you the video of how the run's supposed to be done. This is, yeah, it's it's yeah. absolutely it's honestly it's like magic on ice. Just bear with me. I've unplugged the USB and it's it's decided it wants to be an average. <laughs> oh, no, no, that it shouldn't behave like that though. Do you know what I mean? My wife's just doing some macrame at the moment. Uh, here's honestly this video. It's one of the best speedrun videos out there. Honestly, sit back and watch it. It's uh, honestly, it's it's absolutely flawless.
No, it doesn't. See, I used to have a problem with the strategy here, but now it works. Then for some reason, I don't know. The sewer strategy. Oh, and now the second guy got me instead. You're bullshitting me. There's me like, oh, it works again now. don't get bear with me everyone the laptop now runs slow unless I have the, uh, the hard drive plugged in for some reason it's become super dependent on it my fault bear with me as always on this stream is a tech issue well, there isn't actually a legitimate tech issue, it's just me being fussy. That's the worst thing about me getting into speedrunning. I'm dead fussy about tech. It's got to work a certain way. A certain way. <laughs> yeah, I'm going to start archiving these speedruns, but only these speedruns only at the moment. Just like the whole live stream on YouTube, just so. It's just an idea I got off someone else. It's like their strategy seems to really work. It's like I'd rather test things out, like archiving footage and stuff, than uh, like just leaving it on Twitch. Because after 12 days, all your footage has gone off Twitch anyway, so it becomes absolutely redundant, that footage. Yeah, it disappears after 12 days. A highlight it doesn't. But if you don't highlight, you've done something really good on a foot. Oh, you want to keep a funny moment on your stream. It's gone, is it? It's a lie. Yeah, you can clip it. But mate, it, it's viewers what mainly clip. That's what he said. See, I know all the right things to do now, so it's like really aggressive when. My reset areas are really aggressive now. The much my reset air moments are really early. The, my later resets, I rarely ever pull them off because I find them unnecessary. Once I'm in RPD, I never reset after that. It's like that's done for me. Whatever happens after this happens. I wish I had the same mentality in Resident Evil 3. But on Hunt, it's like, okay, it's fine. legitimate schedule this month as well or well, not this month this week it might change a little bit on times but it's just like a workaround uh with work and stuff i'm just not too sure how streaming's gonna work next week to be honest yeah i think the lady kit's gonna take over most of it because i i'm not really available next week got a lot on uh not just with work but it's like stuff i need to do for myself We got it. We got the dog girl. <sighs> oh no! Keep going, motherfucker. Keep going. Nice. that video you probably save it onto your fucking um, playlist forward, forward. we got it we got it rpd everyone got it right, mr x has changed now during the patch so it's a completely different strategy to what Chief of Chen used. Well, I've worked out my own my own strategy out, but I just wish I still had the Chief of Chen strat. Six second time saver.
wasn't going quick enough. Cheeky shit. Okay, did a lick attack. Got me. Don't get aggressive. Fucking clean. That was a nice corner. Don't get me, Dodro. Don't get me. If I ever did this liquor shot, my wife would probably remarry me. <laughs> it's a miracle, actually. Yeah. It's a one in a thousand chance that ever happened to you. Is that satisfying? Oh, I watched the slowed down version of it on that uh, Maxi Loeb's video. Mm -hmm. I was like, you know how fast. The, the, the whole the review, review yeah. I, and honestly, when, when he did slow down first, I was like, do you know how fast and how fast his brain must have been working in that moment? Yeah. You can't emulate that. Yeah. Like, he just knew. He just fucking knew how to do it. Fifty four pace. Oh shit, twenty second time save. Breathe now. Breathe. <laughs> <laughs> Still on time save, so it's fine. We can PB this. I was close to resetting them. He really upset he really fucking upset me. Mr. X didn't get flashed because I was going too fast. So <laughs> Boop. Oh god, if we get through this door. That tricky doorway, you gotta go left and then take the right, you gotta time it up. I'll show you everyone. Oh! We did it in one go! Let's get through, let's get through. Oh, he slapped me as well, we could have got through. Idiot! He did the slap attack. 50 50 chance of that happening. <laughs> <laughs> We've got to get through the garden clean. Let's do this. There we go. One shot the garden. It's a PB.
eBay. Five second PB. I'm not going to submit any of these until it's like um, sub seven. I'm not going to bother submitting this one. I, I'm not doing that at the moment. I'm not stressing myself out over submitting because I have to just like keep breaking the video down over and over again. And I'd rather. <sighs> I'd rather wait until I've got a time I'm absolutely proud of. But yeah. Oh, I was, a, I was in the 22nd PB at one point, you know. And then Mr. X screwed everything up. Everything else is clean. I even got through that door. You got to find a new strap blanket for Mr. X. Yeah, he doesn't come... come he, you know, like normally you'd, you'd go out with him, let him do his punch attack and you go through it instead. He, he's still in the bathroom now. Instead, so it's just a problem. I never imagined you'd have such a fantastic day. Thank you. Yeah, um, it's girthy. That's the word for it, girthy. And tragically, I also have a man bun. <laughs> so I fit all the stereotypes of a hipster. <laughs> Hello, Olive. Uh, Oliver. GFX2, welcome on in. I I'm great, we just got PB. Honestly, we're gonna do another run. I can't believe we got PB. Oh, we got a new follower. Thank you, Ol uh, Oliver FX. What should I call you? Is that your full name? What do you prefer to be called? Yeah, PB time. You can call me Ollie. Aww. That's fine. I'll throw you a follow back now. Just bear with me. There you go. There's my follow. Hot mess, how are you anyway? I've not seen you on this channel for a while. What's going on? Oh, hello. See your hand waving. Yes. Yeah. <laughs> so Sorry, for some reason on stream, I, I get an incredibly itchy nose. I noticed the other day that I'm always touching my nose on stream. I don't know if that's a thing to do in real life. My beard is amazing. Thank you. Thank you. I, I did. I used beard oil today. I regret the price of that beard oil, though. It was like £10. It was like, what an idiot. But never t I, I don't even spend £10 on shampoo. Life is okay, just working, doing some combo videos lately. Otherwise, life's the same old. Nice. Uh, what have I been doing? I've been trying to sort out the live stream. I've just... Um, <coughs> excuse me. I've just returned back to work, so I'm working at the same time now as trying to live stream, so and surprise, surprise, I absolutely hate my job. Honestly, I hate it. I, I despise it. Like, I hated sitting at home like for two months at a time, but now I'm like, I hate work now. It's just an actual circle of life, isn't it? How are you, Ollie, by the way? I forgot to ask, sorry. How are you today? <sighs> yeah. I just can't believe it, though. Like, why go back to... Like, you don't like spending all your time at home. But then, as soon as you go back to work, you cherish the time you had at home. And you want to go back home, man. It's like, how does that work? Excellent vibes for a better change of pace for you soon. Honestly, I'm just throwing everything into Twitch at the moment. That's how I distract myself from work. You know what I mean, I just make the videos, do my live streams, talk to some people, try and go out at the weekends when, you know, 
and we're not distracted with the whole world. So, it's one of those things. I've seen your channel's getting pretty big now, by the way. I'm impressed. How's the fable, by the way? I don't see the fable anymore. I think it's still live streaming, but. Too slow through the door. That was tragic. K twelve ni toje. Kaiju sten no shoutai. Naruhodo. Shinigami to yobareru wa. Kaiju sten no shigi. Still streaming now. Good. Rakun shike seimon ni mukatteru. Soko de pick up da. Okay. I've nearly quit several times. I'll be honest with you. Just because. Um. Resident Evil 3 is the only reason why I nearly quit live stream 9 times out of 10. For life. It, that game... That game upsets me so much. It's like really bad game to live stream. At a professional level, it's a bad game to live stream. Can I live in your bed? Black, black in. Of course you can live in my bed. I have a feeling I know who that is. I, I, I have a feeling. Yeah, you can live in my bed. It's fine. Let's go. Hey. Charging rent, apparently, though. Can't believe everyone's come back to this stream. It's so good to see. I know who this is. I know who this is. <laughs> I've not seen you in a while either. It's so good to see you. It's like having the whole team back together. <laughs> He's gonna get me. I'm, I'm back as well, I'll be honest with you. I ran a game the other day called Blasphemous and I absolutely enjoyed it. I ended up streaming for five hours and I was like, where did those five hours go? And we had a blast. Honestly, it was like one of the best live streams I've done in so long. Like speed, run speed running is like one of the worst hobbies to pick up. that in a bad way, it's just... Oh. It demands absolute perfection. You demand absolute perfection. I demand absolute perfection. That's the one you want. That's the jump you want, everyone. And you don't want that. Yeah, it's very rewarding. That's the problem, isn't it? When you once you start seeing the rewards of speedrunning, you can't stop anymore. 
I think that's what happened with me on Resident Evil 3. I kept seeing all these rewards, and when I stopped getting rewarded, I was like a dog. You know, who's not getting his uh, treat anymore. So I was getting super aggressive with the, um, with the channel, because I weren't seeing results. Insurance shop. Nice. <sighs> this is a very good run. Bye bye, Mr. X. Nice. Oh, clean. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. Oh. Yeah. This is technically the only place I can actually reset um, inside the police, actual police office. When that happens, it's very uh, it's hard to recover. Seriously, your reflexes are wild. Do you think that? Honestly, no one's told me that before. Is that true? Don't tell me you're just saying that while, for the sake of it. I need to hear that sort of stuff. I don't believe that about me. I don't. I don't believe that. I, I'm not saying I don't believe you. I say I don't believe it in myself. If it's true that my reflexes are wild, this is now you understand why I get so upset with Resident Evil 3. I, I honestly, hot mess, that's like the best thing anyone's ever said to me on a live stream. It's really warm, isn't it? That's the best thing I've ever, ever, best compliment I've ever heard on a live stream. 110%. Wow, I'm so chuffed. <laughs> Thank you so much. Thank you so much. Damn it. Damn it. I need to hear that. That just made my day like a thousand times better. <laughs> if they actually concentrate properly, you see better stuff, to be honest. <laughs> Basically, why I reset there is I need that lady to follow me so that she cancels the second guy. Because if she, basically, if you don't get that lady to cancel you, you cancel the second guy, the second guy that 110% attack you. And that's, that's a reset in itself. <laughs>
Bad start. Super ridiculous start. Very slow. It's ridiculously warm in the UK right now. We keep getting these weird peaks and troughs in uh, um, heat for some reason. It's absolutely ludicrous. K12 ni tojek. Kaiju kiten no shoutai. Naruhodo. Shinigami to yobareru wa. Kaiju kiten no kibu. 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 I feel so bad here at the moment. Like tonight, like all day, it's been quite mild. I mean, I've not felt the heat all day. And then this evening, it's just been like bang straight in the face. set there for the and I'll explain it to you. If that dog hits you, um that's it's a time waste and at the same time it gives enough time for the rest of the dogs to come through. And then basically that bridge is just a hellscape. If you get through that bridge with five different dogs coming through, it's a miracle and it it, it does not happen. There's no video out there where someone's got through there with five dogs chasing them on there. I've tried. I've, I've even tried it when I've made a mistake. It's just, it never, it never comes into fruition. The air is soup. <laughs> Thank you for being here anyway. You see what I mean with the dogs? See how one, two, one, two here, and then the zombie on this uh, this panel. The three other dogs have run down this side. See if I, we do an experiment now, and I try and get through. This zombie will grab me. I'll use a knife, but when I cut through here, 110%. You'll find out. There's the knife. 
<sighs> nah, it's the dog. Just as I said it. It's so the problem is right, it is RNG, but all the all the wrong moments are so predictable. It's so predictable. When it starts going wrong and it starts playing against you, you can almost uh, scene for scene account for what's gonna happen. It's very bizarre, you just can't account for the good times. Welcome to the live stream, everyone. We've got six people in. Thank you very much for being here. We're doing hunk speed runs. We've just got PB about 10 minutes ago. It's been like four months since we got a PB on this game, so. <laughs> it's a miracle. <laughs> Oh, don't, don't worry about going silent. Why are you worrying about that? You don't have to talk all the time on stream. It's just nice to know that you're here. Thank you. Did you end up watching that video? I hope you watched that video. Jiki Chen should pay me because I, I, I share that video to everyone. <laughs> Anyone I meet on the internet, I share them that video just because it's, it's magic for me. It's something I aspire to be like. Oh. Is anyone watching Gamescom at the moment? Dead Island 2 got announced. Yeah, Dead Island 2 got announced. Not, not like the one that was released. Not a full, a full game. Brand new area, everything. It's based in a city this time. Like Los Angeles, yeah. No, but I mean the gameplay, like the modernised. Yeah, yeah, everything's modernised. No, but what if it ends up like, what was that, Back for Blood? You went too far in my opinion. Uh, I think you know the problem with Back for Blood is they they played a nostalgia game and never tried to be their own thing. And that, with Back for Blood, the part where they started to be their own thing was using the card system. But that card system was absolutely ridiculous. Um, it had no place there. I didn't understand it. It was far too complicated. Just what if to go and shoot something? And they made it so complicated. Mm. Because basically, in Left 4 Dead 2, it, it was just solely reliant on your gameplay skills and your understanding of the game mechanics. Like, imagine playing this game at Hunk right now and I could get a card. I could unlock a card that makes me move two times quicker or take two times less damage. How does that fair? How does that make sense? Do you know what I mean? Sorry, but we're just having a rant about games talk. <laughs> I, I just don't feel like enough games are getting announced at the moment. It's just too many rehashes of old shit. <laughs> Why is it so long? Yeah, but I've not been in front of the fan all day. 
Because normally when I'm stood at the till at work, I have that fan blasting on me, don't I? And I feel like I'm a bit warm as soon as I leave work. But I've not been anywhere near the till today. Let's hope we get through this one. Come on. K twelve ni toje ka. Kaiju kiten no shoutai. Naru hodo. Shinigami to yobareru wa ke. Kaiju kiten no shiju. Shinigami san. Rakuun shike seimon ni mukatteru. そこでピックアップだ。了解。うん。うん。うん。Yeah, that's true. That's always the case, isn't it? Especially for a short speed run. Doggo <laughs> behaved himself this time. I love RE1 Remastered. So do I, to be honest. I, if you ask me why, I've played that game way too many times. Yeah, it's it's so quiet that game. Do you know what I mean? Like this is very noisy game, isn't it? But at Resident Evil One's really good. I like Resident Evil One. It's the good stuff. Sorry, it's sleeve rolling up time. It's too it's too long. It's way too long. If the, is that what you've been playing, Black? Black in. Sorry, I have to say the second part to you now. I'm close to 900 hours. You're joking, right? I've just put 600 hours into Resident Evil 3. I'm so ashamed of myself. <laughs> Honestly, every time I look at the time, I'm like, I'm so ashamed. It's like, why? Why have you done that? You could have put six out, 600 hours into learning a language or something. I like, put 600 hours into Res Resident Evil 3. Who's your favourite character to play in Resident Evil 1? Jill or Chris? See, for me, I started liking running Chris bit, Which I was surprised by because I always ran Jill. Uh, no, it's the other way around. Jill's easier, Chris is harder. Because Chris does, doesn't have the lockpick. Jill 100%. Yeah. I thought so. I really like Jill. I like the way Jill moves on that game. If I was doing a knife only run though, I'd only do it on Chris. Jill's animation with a knife on Resident Evil 1 is so aggressive. It doesn't work. It's like it's been poorly programmed or something. Whereas Chris is like a really nice, smooth animation.
Oh, Resident Evil 100%. I'm not a huge fan. Honestly, unpopular opinion, I'm not a huge fan of Resident Evil 2. I honestly, I honestly prefer Resident Evil 1 as such a, a nicer atmosphere. It's more horror in Resident Evil 1. Resident Evil 2 is still sort of an action game. Like, you tell me the scariest part of Resident Evil 2. Because I can't name it. Just bad hour in Gita. Everything's too similar about Resident Evil 2 Remastered. Like, it's, the, it's one of the greatest remasters out there. Do you know what I mean? Out of any game being remastered in recent history. Uh, it is the greatest remaster of all time. Actually, Resident Evil 1 could be classed as one of the greatest remasters of all time. But 2, two, two set the benchmark, didn't it? Okay. Came out 20 years after Resident Evil 1. But I went about the remaster. Uh, the, uh... <sighs> yeah, but I went about number two though. Number two is like one of the greatest remasters of all time. RE2 Remastered is the greatest remaster of all time. It's undeniable. <laughs> It's not the greatest Resident Evil game, but we're talking about games being remastered then. That's a benchmark in its own. Story-wise, Story-wise, it's always going to be number one for me. Just because I, I love, honestly, I love Wesker. I think Wesker is a great villain. Like, I'm really excited that he's coming to Dead by Daylight. <laughs> that that trailer looks so exciting. Have you seen that trailer for Wesker in Dead by Daylight? I've not played Dead by Daylight in a while. Even I'm tempted to come back. Honestly, it looks amazing.
Yeah, I'll probably play Dead by Daylight on stream when it comes out. You know, the Wesker update. Hey? Okay. Yeah. I don't, I don't think it would be a permanent thing. I think it would just like very like brief flash in the pan. Alright, he won't know the windows open, it's fine. Don't do it. I can't believe he got me. I think about Think about it, without RE1 remake success, there wouldn't be more remakes. No, there wouldn't have been. I reckon Resident Evil would have died if it wouldn't have been for this, uh, for the success. But, you know, I was discussing it with someone the other day that Resident Evil 4 was the actual downfall of the original Resident Evil downfall because that's what turned it into an action game. Just look what happened after 4. Uh, number 5 came out, which number 5's not bad, right? I'm not, I'm not disputing that. Five's a decent co-op game to sit down with someone and play. But when it got to number 6, everything just got dead silly. And it was like, it just stopped it, it stopped being realistic at that point. Yeah, like video game realistic, anyway. No, 4 was the downfall. Yeah, for me, I think four, Resident Evil 4 was the biggest mistake they made. Despite it being one of the greatest games of all time, <laughs> it was a mistake. Because that's when it turned into an action game. I think 5 too, yeah. My wife says she thinks 5 is the problem. But I have a different opinion. I, I genuinely believe that uh, 4 was the starting point to some mistakes that Capcom was making. Especially when it came to the action aspect of things. Oh. We had a good run there as well. This room at the moment has been, uh, it's been a bit of a curse. K twelve ni tojek, kaiju shiken no shoutai. Naruhodo, shinigami to yobareru wa kero. Kaiju shiken no shigi. Kaiju shiken no shigi. Shinigami san, rakuun shiken seimon ni mukatteru. Black, black in. Where did you go, by the way? I've not seen you for so long. I know I got been consistent for streaming for a while, but I always thought it, it would always turn up. When I had one viewer, he was still there. <laughs> he was always there, no matter what. <laughs> oh, vacation, right? Oh. I think you told me he was on vacation that before, didn't you? Like before I went quiet on Twitch. Who said you know who I am? Who am I? You are. Oh, what was that other strange name you had now? Ah, uh, it was really offensive. Well, it would be offensive to someone out there. Oh, I can't remember now. I can't remember. You went under a different name previously. I can't remember what that name was. Can't remember. No, yeah, we do know it. He no. No, he won't. He won't tell me. He won't tell me. He knows I know who it is. He 110% knows I know who it is. He, he just knows I can't remember the name. 
sé, güey. Just bear with me, I need to unmute a moment. I've just got to talk about work a moment. Sorry. Hello, I'm back now. I'm not talking about work anymore. Sorry. Uh, I'll, I'll be lurking and doing some workouts and stretches. Thank you so much for lurking. Hello, I'm back now. I'm not talking about work anymore. Sorry. Thank you. Thank you for lurking. Yeah. A red circle instead. Yeah. What's happened to the jewellery one? I need, I need to just... Talking about macrame, sorry. <laughs> I need to actually sit into the meeting. Yeah, I like that. It's fine then. Yeah, I like that. Hello, hot mess. I've returned to a reset. Ah, the life cycle of speed running. Nature is beautiful. Ah, yeah, I know. I've only finished one run tonight, but I've I've learned a few more things about the run, which is good. I just like I've learned things what I know I'm capable of doing. Because I always try and compare myself to PC runners, and that's the biggest mistake you can make. PC runners can run at 120 FPS and I'm stuck at 60 FPS no matter what. So it's like I need to stop trying to think I can emulate what a PC runner can do. But it's good to see about what do you get from the store. We call them corner shops in the UK. <laughs> a corner shop. <laughs> Sounds funny when you uh, talk about someone from a different country. £9.41 though. God, if you're kidding me, right? Why would you stand there for that money? Right now, 
I wouldn't stand around for nine pounds. <sighs> Been very reset heavy the past 20 minutes. I had a good running at one hour, 10 minutes. And then the police station office really screwed me over. This is absolutely wild. Oh, did you get that message about the cold coffee? Read it now, oh, so I don't have to say it. <laughs> なるほど。死神様、ラクオスケ専門に向かってる。そこでピックアップだ。了解。いや。ああ、ノー。ああ、ショーイツモロ。<laughs> That your profile you're on there? Yeah. Bear with me everyone, so much wrong on the Xbox. Both sides. What do you mean? Both sides, it's gone. What is it? Not on there, just a prop drummer. Can you tell me why? No, no, I don't. I know that's what I'm saying. That's what I'm saying. I don't know. Bear with me one more second. Okay, it's concentration time. Oh. I remember the first time I ever completed this and I thought I was shit off, right? I thought, wow. I did the hardest challenge on this day. Honestly, oh. you figure out all the like little tricks, tricks and skips. Not actually, there's no skips in this, but you figure out all the tricks to manipulate the AI. It's not actually a bad time. <laughs> It is kind of hard to speed run in this heat, though. I feel my frustration levels going up. I'm, tr I'm trying to stay uh, cool now. It's just like, it's just way too warm. It's like, so jarring. I tried to commit to full-time speedrunning this a, lot, a while ago, and then the same thing happened. That dog there absolutely hates me. Nine, to five, six times out of ten, I can skip him. And the other times, he will bat me every single run. And he will just say to me, no, you're doing it wrong. When I know I'm not doing it wrong, just the dog doesn't want me to win. 
Keep going. Just test something. It worked! It worked! That, it fucking worked! That's the first time it's ever worked for me. Basically, I, I didn't have to use the shotgun against that zombie. <laughs> That's the first time I've ever made that work. I, I caught it on live stream. Thank fuck for that. I have to go over that later. So, yeah, it is actually, these resets are quite good on this a shorter uh, speed run. Oh. The dog. The dog got me. I just made a miracle happen, the dog still got me. Was that what you were saying, hot mess? The cycle of speed running. How beautiful it must be. You're about a five, five second time saver. If I learn how to do that, um, that zombie thing again one more time. That was so nice. I've only ever seen Chicken Chen do that. I think he's got to be moving at a particular angle for me to be able to uh, take advantage of me being able to get up on that platform before he can bite my ankles. Because you can still get on the platform, but he can still try and eat, uh, chew on your ankles at the same time. Okay. <laughs> One of my dogs is just trumped and it's just like finally made its way up my nose. <laughs> My god, Bo, that's awful. That's bloody awful, man. Whoa, it's dangerous. How's that fat getting worse? It smells like old milk. Oh, I did give him some mozzarella. It might have not agreed with him. Forever, isn't he? Right, so give him some mozzarella while I, while I got a chance. He's not going to Italy anytime soon, is he? <laughs> <laughs> I don't think he could get Bo on a plane at his age, you know. So in the strike. <laughs> Boone. <laughs> Boone's flying the plane home. <laughs> <laughs> Honestly. <laughs> it's so true. He would, he would fly off. Pilot freaked you out. <laughs> out. I managed to do it again. I think we know how to do that chicky chen stick now. Me personally, Chicken Chen invented this speed run. No one else has no ever done it. I reckon he's buried that speed run. That's never gonna happen again. It's, it's dead and buried that. He will have that until he's like 50 years old. You know, like when a new generation comes out and speed running is still a thing at the time. But for me personally, I reckon speed running will die out again. I reckon it's a bit of a phenomenon. I know it's been around for 
decades now, but I, I reckon it will go eventually because when, when mon money gets involved in things, love, it always makes things collapse in the end. I look at most, right, why do companies fall apart? Because of money. They either make too much, make stupid, ambitious choices to make more money and end up smothering themselves and losing all the money in the end anyway. Sorry, we're having an e economic conversation. But it happens though, and that's the thing. I was having this uh, discussion on a live stream the other day, right, about the money involvement on Twitch and like, you know, the subathon thing. I find that to be extremely aggressive. You pay me to live stream. So what they do is they, they say, I'll stream for six hours in a block, yeah. but if you want any more time coming on that live stream, you've got, you've got to pay, you've got to subscribe to me to add five minutes onto. Why would someone want to do that? I feel like why would someone pay for someone? I wouldn't want to pay someone. For I, I reckon it's professional begging. I don't think I'd ever, ever, even if we uh, made it to like the middle ground in the live streaming community and stuff, I don't think I'd ever do anything like that where I'd force people and say, oh, I'm going to charge you for my time. Yeah, for charity, anytime, any, anytime. Yeah, but I wouldn't do it. I, no, I wouldn't do it just because I need to make money that week. That's what you're basically saying to me. I'm poor this week, so you need to start paying me to stay on 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 air. What if someone just genuinely likes your content? Why can't they just be able to watch your content for free? Yeah. I remember subscribing to someone once, and he was like, you know this is free, don't you? Oh, did they? Yeah, that's what he said to me. He said, you know this is free to watch, right? You don't have to actually give me anything. I'm not bothered. But he works at a hospital and stuff, so obviously he's making good money what he does. So he clearly does live streamers purely out of a, a hobby standpoint. I'm not, I'm here to make money. And that's the biggest mistake of all, you know? going into it thinking you're going to make cheddar cheese and like me and you know that's that's not the case yeah he makes a lot of money honestly that's the show that's the show what he does he makes a lot of it's like um a live reality show, isn't it? Wins the redemption. Do you know what I mean? You're watching this train train wreck happen in on live. Now he's like screaming on avocado. I'm not name dropping people. Sorry, I'm just discussing um, the internet and it's. Um, Grossness for money. And it's a shame what's happened there. Yeah, he was a true figure. He worked with all those fake, fake figures who did it for Instagram. And, and anyone can argue this with me, those people exist. People become figures for the Instagram posts because they're going to become famous or something. But fundamentally, if you're online on a social media platform, you're not famous. You're doing the same thing everyone else is doing. Everyone's got Facebook and uh, Instagram and stuff. Apart from me, but that's just my own, own preference.
<sighs> Suffering now. K twelve ni toje. Kaiju shiten no shoutai. Naruhodo. Shinigami to yobareru wa kaiju shiten no shigi. Anshin shina shinigami san. Rakuo shike seimon ni mukatteru. Soko de pick up da. Yokai. He's about that, isn't he? Do that again. He's still happy about that. <laughs> Oh, that scene you play for a while, Nico. Oi! He's just been playing with that then. Go play with that. I'll play with him a little bit. Yeah. They're chuffed about it. I'll be him that who's ate his fish, thinking it's food. How greedy that dog is, honestly. <laughs> How did Bear with me, everyone. <laughs> We're going. My wife's going to take us through the story to how we came home with two cats today. We nearly came home with two cats. Is he? Out doing a flight with someone like that, no. it's dangerous. So, one hundred and ten percent. If I knew, if I knew that was the way someone was inclined, I would dare go into that house. But he's now, he said he's got somewhere for his cat. How old is he? Hi. I don't think his top is meant as that man, bro. He had sewn down. paranoia about sound then for some bizarre reason which was totally 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 on this it will take me a couple of more live streams to get back into the swing of things so honestly blasphemous live stream the other day was like the best live stream i've done in so long i was so happy on that live stream just like i was zoned out just like playing for the sake of playing the game and i completed it in only two days I, I did like 96% of the game at the end. 
I was I missed out only missed like very few things out of the 100 percent achievement and I was like damn it. Should have carried on but I cycled over to New Game Plus like an idiot. Absolutely adore that game. I don't even know why it's so it's so difficult. So hooked on that, weren't I? How long did I spend on that in the end? It must have been like six to seventy hours in the end. You couldn't even get me off that, could you? Didn't even matter how many times you tried, I was on that for days. That was the one that never played Resident Evil at the time as well. It was just chill, wasn't it? It was just a chilled out game to watch. For my standard, oh my god, we're finally in the sewers. <laughs> uh, I, I liked it for what it was, you know. Do you know what I mean? Yeah, it, it was it was stressful at times. It never went the way you needed it to go. You know, even though you thought you had a good seed. Yeah, a complete chance. You, you could never, ever get the same map ever again. No, they don't. No, roguelike games are quite popular, but the way they made the roguelike, no. It wasn't, no, I haven't seen a roguelike be made like that in a very long time. You know, like 2D, 2D sort of platform. It was very different, weren't it? I, I, honestly, 10 out of 10 for me. You know, if we could put a legitimate review out there for it, I'd put, I'd say that's a 10 out of 10 game. If you're ever in a really depressive patch or anything like that, just blow, blow that game on, right? And uh, you, you're done. Switch it on. Right, okay, we're on PB. Wow, it took this long. I don't have the sound on, bear with me. I've just listened to the soundtrack a little bit too much at the moment. This was more a chilled out run, this one, tonight. I just needed to... I, I, I personally wanted to do a live stream and just wanted to get the ball rolling on the hunt runs. Because my aim is to try and aim for top five on this and then quit it. I know I could never go world record standards for this. But I'm, I'm going to be super happy if we can at least reach a top five standard. Apparently it would take me like a month anyway just to get sub, sub seven minutes. Grinder, but then I'm like, Chicka Chen spent in the end, he did 348 live streams before he ever got the world record for this game. 348 live streams every single day, three hour blocks every day, 348 days. Dedication, absolute sheer dedication. Take me out off to him, inspiration. Okay, worst shot in the game. Oof, missed yeah. it. Oh, well, the run's not dead. That's a that's a nice surprise. God, that shot is like a once in a lifetime <laughs> thing to happen. I just tried doing it there. I was like, nope. I've relearned the Mr. X trick again now. That's coming through again now. Because I listened to uh, what Chicka Chen was saying. You're not actually supposed to do a quick turn. You're just supposed to move the analog stick as normal as you would do anyway. And that's what confuses it. Yeah, like I just did then. Like he was nothing to me. This one's easy. He's in the bad spot. He's in the bad spot. I'm for it. She's not woke up. Nice. I'm gonna fi I I'm finish this one here. I'm gonna finish the stream tonight. Super hours in tonight, so it's fine. We'll be back tomorrow. Uh, uh, tomorrow will just be like a fair live stream, I'll be honest with you. Just like maybe an hour patch somewhere here or there. Because I feel. Uh, I could have done one in the morning, but I need to go out in the morning and do a lot of things, so can't really do one tomorrow. Just got things to do. Push through. 
if, if I didn't have so much to do tomorrow, I probably would have done one. Until I had to go to work. But... This one is... This one. That's going to Manchester tomorrow. What's that real? Uh, bear with me until after the stream. Might PB this. This would be a nice, a nice way to finish the stream with a finished run. At least we PB'd on stream tonight, so I'm happy with this one. Very happy. We got a five second PB. It's been like nearly two months since we ever did made anything happen on this game. Straight for the corridor again. Oh! oh. It's over. Damn it. Whatever the time is, let's just finish it. Send in the high. Yeah, that's how bad it is. That guy never normally gets me, but. Let's go for the garden, let's go. Eight oh seven. What a tragedy. It's been a good live stream either way. Thank you to everyone who took that part tonight. We had good numbers tonight as usual. I should actually say as usual now. Again. It's been a long time since we could say that. It's been good. But yeah, we're back tomorrow with Honk. It'll be brief tomorrow, like I said, just because we've got stuff going on in the morning and in the afternoon, so if it doesn't happen tomorrow, then I'll just do some extra the day after, something like that. It is what it is. I'll do one on. What day? Friday. Friday. Okay. Uh, late. Sorry, I keep saying comp. Uh, just changed the name for this now. It's Lady Kit. Lady Kit will be on Friday on Dante Must Die. She'll be on camera as usual, so don't worry. That'll be okay. Uh, Dante must die, so everyone enjoyed that last time from what I saw, so do you know what I mean? It'd be a nice change up. I think I'll be on I think uh, Friday, we'll probably be going out on Friday, so probably may if I get up early enough in the morning, I'll probably smash a two hour live stream out before I have to go work. Saturday Saturday might be a six till seven, one hour live stream. Sunday we might smash one in for two hours at some point in the day where it's absolutely quiet in the day. And then Monday and Tuesday I'm off work, so uh be back to business on Monday and Tuesday. That'll be like maybe four or five hour live stream days there. Just depending on uh what I'm feeling on the day. But I'll still be doing hunt for a while now. Just because I don't want to do full game speed runs at the moment. It's not something I feel like I want to do anymore. I'd rather just do short burst speed runs. 
instead of committing to something as big as a full game. And then we'll draw back to Resident Evil 3 in many, many moons time. If we don't come back to it, I don't, I'm not really bothered anymore. It's, it is what it is now. It's uh, I've got a good position in the world on the leaderboards. It's like, why bother? Why, why strive for any more on that? It's, I worked bloody hard enough to get where I got to. So, I know that sounds like really defeatist and stuff, but honestly, I, I got... This isn't like the most important part, but I never got real any big traction from it. So it was like it's nothing to worry about. I did, I never got like this personal gratification out of it in the end. It started uh, diminishing that feeling in the end. It never came about for me. Stress yeah, it became just about stress in the end instead of like um, feeling anything nice about it. In the early days, yeah, it was nice. You no. Know, those early day feelings quickly, quickly de depleted. But anyway, that's my rant over. End of stream rant. I'm going to try and get some nicer shirts for the stream, to be honest. This, this, I feel like this one's just too dark. Do you know what I mean? What do you think? Like nicer, brighter shirts. Like, not Hawaiian, but... Do you know what I mean, don't you? There's something a bit different. Uh, I don't want to wear. I, I'm so, I, honestly, I went. Normally, when I leave the house, I don't even check what I'm wearing. But then when I was about to go on the stream today, I was like, oh, what do I wear? <laughs> Not for any particular reason, just I just didn't want to look awful. But this shirt's awful. I, I back. No. Yeah, it's too big now. I, just, I fall out of favor with clothes too quickly. I like them for like five, we five wears. <laughs> and then I don't like them no more. <laughs> Alright, we're done everyone. I'll see you at the next live stream.